All right, so it's extremely windy up here. We are on Easter Island still. Uh, we just climbed up to tallest old volcano. I think it's the point of highest elevation on the whole island. Uh, yeah, excuse the wind. Sorry about that. It was, well, it was an unnecessarily long hike because the path is not very well laid out, and so we had a couple of wrong detours that ended up in taking us to some like, forests and stuff. But uh, the views up here, as usual, are pretty spectacular. There's been a few people, and actually I see some coming here on the left. But for the most part, we've been out here alone. There's what I think is Molly's hair. I'll back up slightly. Hi, Molly. There's, I'm pretty sure it's a wild horse, because no one seems to be up here. There doesn't seem to be any property up here. There's more horses down there that you probably saw. I'm going to pan a little bit just so you can see some of these views. I'll just do it slowly, not give anyone motion sickness. But, yeah, we get pretty much panoramic views of the whole island, which is pretty small, because as you can see, it's pretty much water in every direction. The hill that I just panned over, we were standing there a little bit ago, and you can see the water on the other side, so you're pretty much in the middle of nowhere. But, uh, second there's that pile of wood which is really just meant to mark the spot but uh, we just watched Lord of the Rings so I'm pretty sure it's the first fire you light when Gondor is in trouble <laughs> I'll do one more turn recently yeah extended editions what like 12 hours worth yeah alright there's a guy hanging out up there but you'll be able to see it Zoom in a little bit. That big old chunk of wood. Anyways, I think these might be the best views on the whole island because we're so high up. It was worth the hike to get here. What Molly described as very easy and what Ryan describes as not easy at all. But uh, it's time for us to head back down. Wave goodbye, Molly. <laughs>